Good evening, Living Waters. Welcome to our time of prayer uh, for Monday, July 6th. I know, crazy. Already July 6th. Um, we are going to be using a prayer today that was sent to me from one of you. Carmen Pasquale sent this. So, uh, thanks, Carmen. Uh, shout out. Uh, as always, if you have prayers that you found meaningful and want to send for us all to pray together, please. Uh, email them to me, and uh, we will use them. Uh, we've been doing this more and more, I'm noticing recently. That's great, because it's harder and harder to find prayers, <laughs> it seems. So, uh, yeah, this is great. Uh, so we're going to do that. We're going to add our own petitions, of course. Uh, yeah, thanks for being here. Give people another eh, 24 seconds to get on. Oh, and if you are joining us for Fellowship After Dark tonight, Singo has returned. Not sure on the theme, but Singo has returned. Always a good time, no matter what the theme is. So, all right. Perfect. Let us pray. Holy God, we are burdened by division and arguing that is more prevalent in this time. Please help us to understand what is and is not in our control. We pray for the church to be a light uh, in a time of darkness. And remembering our identity is uh, that of being your child, that we would conduct ourselves in a manner worthy of the gospel. We pray for compassion. We would learn to listen to one another, and we would be compassionate towards those who are confused or afraid. We would weep with those who weep. We pray for the oppressed. Give us a heart for those in need and for those who are oppressed. We pray for the church's relationship with God and with each other. We pray that we would seek your face, read your word, and encourage one another in truth. We pray for peace, a peace that would not Give in to a spirit of fear, but embrace your Holy Spirit. Maybe we be known as bold ones carrying peace with us wherever we go, and speaking peace with whomever we encounter. Help us to lay our anxieties at your feet, and not let them stir in our hearts. We pray for the church to remember God. We would remind each other of your faithfulness and find hope and encouragement in all that you have done. We pray for heartfelt worship together we focus on you and what we have in common by praying and worshiping with one another. We pray for humility. Show us how to honor those in authority over us, no matter who is in leadership, but allow us to certain, cert, clearly discern and humbly speak out against whatever is blatantly contrary to your word. Let us give thanks to God. Thank you for this moment in history that is being used to test us and stretch us and cause us to cling more tightly to you. You are our only hope in these days. Help us in this time. We also add our petitions now. We add pray for grief support for Sam, healing for Paula. We pray for Ellen, Anthony, Josh, Cody, Mike, Monica, as they are um, facing difficult challenges at the moment. Continue to pray for wisdom and faith for Joe and Mary Beth. Uh, we mourn with Tracy, Melissa, Farley, and Matthew's family and Al's family. We pray for healing for so many, for Jenny, Ron, Sandy, Frank, Pedro, Don, Lorraine, Mary Kay, Susan, Ida, <laughs> And that's and all those who are in need in this desperate hour. We pray for clergy and congregations that they work together in this time. We ask that you heal wounds and grant a mindset of grace and understanding in these days. We pray for our the world we live in, your beautiful creation. 
We give thanks for its beauty, and we ask that you help us to care for it. God, we pray that you, that we would be an instrument of peace and unity, one that finds your peace and hope uh, in this world, in this time. Help us to help others. In your name we pray. Amen. Well, thank you for joining me for this time of prayer. And like I said, we have Singo tonight. Uh, so you're joining us for that. That's at 8 p.m. Otherwise, I will see you tomorrow. Have a good night. Oh, and if you are looking for the, the discussion guide for um, Hamilton also came out today. So if you're looking for that, you watched it. Great, 